It's the reason behind many recent fires across our area. Lithium ion batteries. Lithium batteries are in so many household devices and it's very, very important how you use them and how you dispose of them. They're in cordless power tools and vacuums, laptops, tablets, cell phones, toys, hoverboards, and electric bikes and scooters. Correct handling can mean life or death. These batteries are not unsafe when properly charged, when using the proper charging equipment, when charging them in the proper place, such as on a countertop versus on someone's bed. At the Nassau County Fire Service Academy, fire officials shared safety tips showing the right way to use, store, and dispose of these items to prevent disaster from happening. Problems come in when you charge these things overnight and you forget about them. That's what causes problems. It starts to distress the battery, overheats it, and as the phone or the toy gets older, it can happen easier. They advise users to read the manufacturer instructions in their entirety for use, charging, and storage of the device. Only use the charger that's meant for the device, not third-party products. Avoid charging on a combustible surface, like wood or bedding. Do not charge in an exit way of a room or building. And when possible, charge electric bikes and scooters outside. So far this year, across New York City, the FDNY has seen more than 80 fires caused by lithium-ion batteries from electric bikes and scooters, which have led to two deaths and more than 20 injuries. Last year, four New Yorkers were killed in fires caused by the batteries. And because of how hard it is to put out these types of fires, officials warn to not attempt to put it out, but instead get out of your home as soon as possible and call 911. In Bethpage, Michelle Ross, PIX11 News.